YouTube, what's going on? I uh, just woke up to the uh, pounding sound of FedEx slamming on my door. Uh, I finally got my package that I was waiting for that I've been so excited about. I uh, just got my brand new uh, my brand new marker in. Uh, it's also coming with a tank, tank cover, and a new die rotor hopper. Don't really need the rotor hopper, but I got it anyway. Uh, so I thought I'd uh, invite you into my domicile one more time so you guys can share this with me. Let's check this out. I, uh, so far, all I managed to do was open up the box. Uh, just so I didn't have to hack away at a knife with a knife uh, at the box. But uh, let's see what we got going on here. Let's see. Look at these packing peanuts, Jesus Christ. Alright, oh, we got this tank sticking out of the top here. Nice. We got a nice little CP stubby tank. No air. Go fake. Yeah. Uh, it's kind of good grip on the bottom. It's not too bad. Tank looks good, actually. Alright. One down. Uh-oh. -uh. Green rotor. Kind of sick. It's going to look good on the gun. Cool. Put this aside. Now for what I've been waiting for. Been waiting for this for far too long. And finally has come home. Let's get in here. Make a mess. You ready for this? You ready? Oh. Even the box is gorgeous. Look at that. Love the solid design. Planet Eclipse has always done really well with making very solid packaging to make sure their guns aren't uh, aren't damaged. Uh, you can just break it down, throw it in your bag, and you're off to the races. You don't have to worry about uh, throwing it in a separate uh, separate carrying case or anything like that. Uh, their cases are fairly solid. Uh, and that's pretty much for any of their markers, too. It's my, my E-Tech box. See my E-Tech box right here? It's nice and solid. Uh, I've never had a problem with anything dinging up inside, so, yeah. But uh, let's get right down to it. Uh, I ordered this gun uh, off eBay. Won it, uh, won it in a in a bidding war. Uh, won this whole package for eight thirty five, uh, free shipping. Uh, so I got the one hundred and sixty dollar rotor, hundred and I don't know thirty five dollar stubby tank, uh, the cover, and a nine month old marker, which is uh, normally a twelve fifty, normally a twelve hundred and fifty dollar marker. Uh, for uh, for eight eight thirty five, uh, so like I always say, shop online, find something. I, I'm I'm a big fan of supporting your local store, but sometimes your local store just can't give you the deal that you want. Um, and I'm all about as paintball is expensive enough without spending money that you don't have. So let's crack in here, and you guys will be able to see the gun that I've been waiting quite some time to get. All right, ready for this? Ego 10 Blink has come home. Oh man, that's perfect. Look at this. This is flawless. Barrel kit. We have our marker. Oh, this is perfect too. There's, I don't know how well you can tell, but there's not one mark on this. This is beautiful. Oh, something underneath. Oh, it's a, uh, a die speed feed. Uh, I am not going to be using this. I know for a fact that I'm going to break this after one day of play. I've already broken two of these. Uh, I don't know how well you can tell, but if you haven't had the uh, chance to check this out, each one of these is only held on, you can see on the bottom better, by two little spots. So once one of those little spots breaks, this piece is now useless. And once this one piece is useless, the whole thing is useless. So save your money. Don't get that. Now back to my baby here. Let's check this guy out. This is actually uh, in, in perfect condition. It looks absolutely perfect. Uh, it's only a few months old, obviously. But, you know, people go out, they play, they scratch up their guns and everything. This does not have a nick on it. Not not one mark. Let's check the barrel out. Usually there's wear and tear at the tip of the barrel. Yeah, just a touch. I mean, on the camera you can't even tell. But uh, the smallest, slightest, little insignificant little discoloration at the tip. I'm not even worried about that. Not in the least. Let's put this guy together and see what she looks like.
and reverse threaded barrels because you know that's just how Eclipse does. Squeeze that guy up, <coughs> and there she is. My brand new ish, <laughs> brand new to me, uh, Eagle Blink. That I've been longly awaiting. I ordered this, uh, I sent in my payment on the 20th. Uh, he, I guess, had a problem shipping it out. He didn't ship it out until the 20, uh, 24th, uh, Christmas Eve. And I finally just got it today, today being uh, the 29th. So once he did send it out, I got it relatively quickly. Uh, let's go ahead and take this barrel down a little more. Nice and snug. Um, the tank that he gave me, uh, obviously, is not going to have any air in it, but my, uh, my 6845 does have air in it, so I'm going to air this guy up, and I'm going to dry fire it a couple times, if I can figure out how to do that. Before I do that, I'll show you the board here. Uh, it's got a nice big screen. See the size of the screen? I just turned it on. That's, uh, I'll power it off, and I'll let you, uh, I'll let you see what it looks like once it comes on. Alright, so this is our uh, our new screen. It's really, actually, pretty big. Pretty big size screen. Uh, let's go ahead and power it up. Here you go. Alright. So let's go ahead. We'll hook up our tank. Come Undo the valve here. And we will hook this guy up. Alright. Got the blank hooked up to our beautiful tank here. Gonna gas up the gun. And see how it sounds. Should be a nice hiss. Here we go. Ooh, that was quiet. No. Oh yeah. Let's go ahead and just pop off a few shots with this. Wowza. Not too shabby. Pretty loud. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw my, uh, my hopper on this. Not going to use the... Uh, Here's the new one, but, uh, you know what, let's use the new one. Why not? Dial this back a little bit. Love that thumb screw. Makes, uh, makes everything a lot easier, especially when you, uh, once your hopper's off, you can tighten it down and the, uh, the feed neck clamp doesn't slam around. So you can tighten it down much. <laughs> Alright. So here's what we're looking at, guys. We have our rotor on top of our brand new blink to the tank. And what I'm going to do is grab my less than amazing paint out of my makeshift <laughs> ball caddy. We're going to go ahead and dump some balls in. We're going to go to town. Oh, that's nice. Didn't even see that. Inside the uh, inside the rotor was a uh, barrel bag, Smart Parts barrel bag. They always have some girl or something on the cover of their uh, barrel bags, apparently. There you go. Boom, boom, boom. Barrel cover's up there. Let's go ahead and load this guy up. not going to rip too much. I'm just going to put maybe a third of a hopper in. I'm not looking to blow through all my paint today. But, uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to shoot at my, uh, my little makeshift target across the room over there. I'll try and, uh, try and zoom in on it. But uh, that guy right there is what we're shooting at. Gun is hot. Balls are loaded. Can't even see him. 
What's going on? Alright. Let's see here. I need to make a like a stand or something <laughs> so uh, we can uh, accurately see what's going on here. But uh, let's see. We can uh, flip over my crate. How's that work? Besides having the camera full. There we go. That will be sufficient. Well, it definitely rips. <laughs> There's actually uh, even a little tiny spot on the lens. I can wipe that off real fast. <laughs> but uh, that's my new gun, bro. Uh, definitely is going to be uh, nasty on the field. I can't wait to get it out on the field. Um, but that's what I got. So we have the Ego 10 Blink. Uh, the uh, rotor go on top of it. The uh, CP tank. The CP uh, tank cover. Got all that for 835 I'm not really complaining about that. It's an unbelievable marker. And uh, now I got it. Uh, so like I always say, shop smart. Take your time. Uh, don't impulse buy. That's like the worst thing you can do when you're trying to buy uh, buy one of your guns. All right. So uh, like I always say, have a good time. Go out and play with your head and play with your heart. Have a great night. And uh, how is out, man? Have a good one.